Time to get your geek on. Okay, so my film is called Art of the Prank. It's a documentary feature about the greatest media prankster of all time, Joey Skaggs. Art of the Prank features a lot of Joey Skaggs' greatest hoaxes, but it also features an ongoing hoax that has not been revealed yet. I've been introduced to Joey by a producer I was working with in Rome, and so at first he told me, you know, we it's, there's a possibility of doing a film about this man here, his name is Joey Skaggs. And I say, you know, I never heard of Joey before at the time. And he said, you know, I told him, show me something, you know, what is, who, who's this guy? And he gave to me a 2020, 2020 piece about Joey. So that night I watched this 2020 piece about him. I realized what he does and what he's done in his, you know, his entire career. And I've been completely blown away by his art, you know, because it's truly, as far as I'm concerned, an art form itself. As a filmmaker, uh, you learn a lot from, first of all, making a documentary, but I've learned a lot by making a documentary about a hoaxer, because he's basically the greatest storyteller ever, you know, you could ever meet. Uh, he comes up with stories that need to be concise, that needs to be interesting, that needs to have, you know, a beginning, a development, and an end. You know, it's something that I can relate a lot as a, as a storyteller, as a, as a filmmaker. So this is probably the, the thing I, I've learned from being next to, to someone like Joey Skaggs. I can say that I'm a masochist in a way because I tried to convince him to do something contemporary that I could follow. So it was like my fault. I mean, you don't ask Joey to do something. You know, he has to come up with, with, with his own concept because he's, a, again, he's a true artist. So I had access to almost 150 hours of footage plus photos, articles, you know, about Joey's hoaxes. So you can make a great film about what he, what he's done in his, you know, in 50 years of very prolific career. But you know, as far as my story, the story that I really want to try, you know, that I try to, to tell, I needed him to come up with a concept, a new one that I, you know, a new hoax that I could follow to get really inside the mind of the prankster and show you how, you know, how he develops his concepts, how he come, you know, how first of all how he comes up with ideas and how he's, he he put he puts pieces together how he develops the hoax and you know and how hard it is to wait for the results you know you could have done that with just the archival footage because basically you know you only have the outcome and maybe some back you know backstage kind of thing and and the other thing that is really hard to tell with you know, with just the archive is that each story is a single story you know with a beginning a middle and an end and they're like really you can make a film out of a single hoax if you want but you know I, my decision was like I need to ask Joey to come up with something for me to follow and I'm willing to wait for that because I'm not saying you know you need to come up with something in one month that's not how it you know doesn't work like that, like that with Joey so we are doing our film festival run right now. Uh, just go on artofthepranktheMovie.com. We have a page for all our next screenings. And follow us on Facebook if you want, and Instagram, Twitter. Just look for Art of the Prank the Movie.